National Electoral Commission has said that election will not hold in 240 polling units across 28 states and the federal capital territory. The INEC chairman, Professor Mahmoud Yakubu, stated this during a meeting with political parties on Monday, February 13, 2023. Yakubu stated that no voters indicated interest to transfer to those units during the last continuous voter registration due to insecurity. Hence, the total polling unit for elections is now 176,606. He noted that the commission would make a comprehensive list of these polling units. The INEC chairman explained, Let me therefore start with the issue of polling units. You may recall that in 2021, with your support and that of other political stakeholders, the commission successfully expanded voter access to polling units 25 years after the last delimitation exercise in 1996. Consequently, the number of polling units increased from 119,973 to the current figure of 176,846. At previous meetings, we also briefed you on our efforts to redistribute voters to the polling units in order to avoid the congestion that made voting cumbersome in many of them nationwide. This requires the redistribution of voters to new polling units in proximate locations, where they are separated by distance. This must be done after consultation with the voters. This has been done by our state offices nationwide. However, there are 240 polling units with self-registered voters spread across 28 states and the federal capital territory. They range from one polling unit to 12 polling units in each state and the federal capital territory, except Saraba and Inu states, with 34 and 38 polling units respectively. No new registrant chose the polling units and no voters indicated interest to transfer to them during the last continuous voter registration, mainly for security reasons. This means that no elections will hold in these polling units. Professor Yakubu Foda said, In our avowed commitment to transparency, the Commission is making available to Nigerians a comprehensive list of these polling units by name, code number, and their locations by state, local government, and registration area. With this development, the number of polling units where elections will hold nationwide on February 25, 2023 and March 11, 2023 is now 176,606. Hard copies of the list are included in your folders for this meeting. Above all, Nigerians deserve the right to know the locations of these polling units. Accordingly, the soft copy of the list has been uploaded to our website and social media platforms for public information and guidance. The INEC chairman added that observations from the just concluded mock exercise showed that registered voters could not identify their polling units, advising voters to confirm the locations of their polling units through a dedicated portal on our website. He said, closely related to the distribution of voters in the identification of polling units, from the feedback we received from our officials and accredited observers following the recent nationwide mock accreditation using the BVAS, it is clear that some voters could not easily identify their polling units. This should not happen on election day. Consequently, the Commission is advising voters to confirm the locations of their polling units through a dedicated portal on our website. In addition, all voters who have been assigned to new polling units will receive text messages from the Commission indicating their polling units. We have also compiled the register of such voters and our state offices will give it wide publicity, especially for those who may not have provided their telephone numbers during voter registration or those whose numbers may have changed. Voters can locate and confirm their polling units before election day by sending a regular text or WhatsApp message to a dedicated telephone number. Details of the simple procedure will be uploaded to our social media platform shortly.
As you are already aware, we have less than two weeks to the 2023 general election. The Commission is finalizing the issuance of 1,642,386 identification tags for the polling and collation agents nominated by the 18 political parties made up of 1,524,301 polling agents and 68,085 coalition agents. I urge the chairman and leaders of political parties to ensure that only agents accredited by the commission and wearing the correct identification tags appear at polling units and coalition centers during elections. A situation where two or more agents claim to represent a political party resulting in commotion at polling units or coalition centers is unacceptable. Only identification tags issued by the commission will be recognized on election day and violators are liable to arrest and prosecution for impersonation. Turning to the ongoing electionary campaigns, Yakubu stated that the commission is concerned about violent attacks on supporters of political parties across the board, resulting in the loss of life in some cases. Let me once again appeal to chairman and leaders of political parties to continue to call your candidates and supporters to order. I also call on the security, intelligence and law enforcement agencies to arrest, investigate and prosecute anyone involved in violent conduct including incendiary statements capable of inciting a breach of the peace. From Lagos, this is Fisunabuku, News Express, Nigerian Television.